Tom DeLonge was hit with heat stroke and vomited during Blink-182's performance in South America earlier this week. The rock band played Tuesday at Asuncionico in Asuncion, Paraguay, and DeLonge shared a harrowing behind-the-scenes account on his Instagram two days later about how he got heat stroke and became ill during the set. This was about one minute before heat stroke hit. DeLonge wrote in the caption of the photo that shows him on stage soaked in sweat with his head bowed fell to my knees, everything went blurry, then wobbled to the side of the stage and vomited for a bit. Super fun. The vocalist slash guitarist went on to say that his bandmates Mark Hoppus and Travis Barker made up for lost time while he recovered. Man, this was not something I've ever felt before, he added. 95 degrees at 11 p.m. on stage. But. I made it back and finished the show. Cause that's what Navy SEALs do. Fan footage shared on social media shows the moment DeLong walked off stage at the end of the band's performance of More Than You Know. Hoppus and Barker then went on to play Happy Holidays, You Bastard three times in a row before DeLong came back on stage, announcing that he vomited but was already feeling better. The band finished the set with 15 more songs. Blink 182 reunited last year during Weekend One of Coachella for the trio's first performance together in nearly a decade since DeLong left the band in 2015 to study UFOs, write novels, direct movies, and record music with his own band, Angels and Airwaves. Alkaline Trio's Matt Skiba stepped in for DeLong following his departure, recording multiple LPs with the band. Meanwhile, Hoppus was diagnosed with stage 4 diffuse large B-cell lymphoma in the summer of 2021, but confirmed that he was cancer-free in September of that same year. DeLong came back to the band as a result of Hoppus' cancer diagnosis, and the original trio has been playing together on a massive world tour that continues through the summer.